Good morning guys, it's Wednesday, and here in Lynchburg we have a grand 39 degrees weather, so we went from like 60s to that in one day, and I'm about over it, but I'm not going to complain too much because it's sunny outside, as you guys can tell, that's just outside that I'm still using my MacBook Pro instead of a point .2 computer, but um, last night my brother and I put a bar of Christmas lights outside, and they were pretty interesting to work with because they're what's called icicle lights, you have like the normal string lights, but then you have sort of branches of lights that kind of come off the string and so it was a lot of tape and a lot of stringing things around so we had a couple of pillars just outside of the door one railing that goes down the concrete steps being that Christmas is my favorite season it's my favorite time of the year just because everyone's hearts are so open and receptive and everyone seems to be so much more happy it's just a wonderful time of the year hence it being called the most wonderful time of the year I didn't mind it because I mean it wasn't even that cold outside I was out there like hands in a short sleeve shirt and flip-flops and that never happens this time of year in Lynchburg, Virginia. Like usually you're out there dressed up like the Michelin man because it's generally that cold this time of year. Now we have pretty much all of our lights up so it's, it's an exciting time. Today I have to work at Macy's 11 to 5. I'm going to be going there in a while at first. Meg and I are going to try to hit up Chick-fil-A for breakfast because I have a gift card from one of my co-workers. It was a wonderful Christmas present. So um, we've been trying to get to breakfast for a while and I never had the time to do it because I always make my breakfast super early in the morning and then I'm just like off to work. But because it's Wednesday, I'm not actually going to be going into the office. I work from anywhere else that I have an internet connection, but it's just my time to focus being that I'm out of the office. And Megan is, is basically done with school for the semester. I think we're going to try to hit that up. I also have to help one of my friends with a website that our church is hosting. So it's called h2olife.org and I'll put a link at the bottom just below here. Check that out. It's basically just to fund wells in Guatemala is where they're going to be going to because they've been doing this for years but now she is in charge of the website stuff and she's, she's come to me for assistance because I'm the web administrator for TRBC. I've been very grateful to help her because I, I've known her most of my life. It's been pretty chill so far. Last night we went to a Christmas party but then afterwards we finished watching Star Wars uh, Episode 1. Yeah, I know. We are watching Episode 7, Force Awakens, tomorrow. So we have a little bit of catching up. To do. Sorry, I just got another important email. I, phew, Nine o'clock. It's it's like the time everybody wakes up and realizes. Talk to Justin. The highlight of my day though yesterday was okay. So the new Pentatonix video came out for the first Noel. Just about everybody in that video has a shining moment, almost like the music video for George of the World. Something about the first Noel. I think it's because my favorite member, honestly. You gotta say it's Avi, being that there's stuff that I admire about him, especially his humility and the deep voice, obviously. But he's such a great guy. I've watched so many different videos of Pentatonix and just like seeing him, his demeanor, his his personality. He's such a cool guy and one person I would love to meet at some point in my life. But I tweeted him out just saying it's too darn good, you know, I'm a straight guy, but you're gonna have to chill. <laughs> Hashtag too darn good, hashtag the first Noel, and I put up their video, and not too long after that, he liked it. And not only did he like the tweet, but he followed me, and that was really cool. They're one group that, before I die, I need to see them. Them and Josh Groban. So... <laughs> Uh, which is funny because they just, uh, just Pentatonix just released a song on their last CD um, before the Christmas one that they just put out where he is the feature. They were like, we need to get Josh Groban and Avi to do a duet for this. They're somehow similar. I think it's both that they're white guys with beards that sing really well. So anyway, <laughs> I'm going to be hopefully going out and getting breakfast and stuff before I lose track of time. I will come back to you guys later, probably after my shift at Macy's. Got a busy day today. I will catch you guys later home from work. I know it's it's like 625 right now. Um, I'll probably even put a timestamp down there or there wherever it appears. And uh, wow, I'm, I'm pretty tired physically, kind of mentally tired a little bit too, but man, it was a longer shift than it should have been. And I'm not complaining because I enjoy working at Macy's, which is what I just came from. It was from 11 to 5. I got there a little bit late because I was meeting with one of my friends who basically just needed a website to be worked on. That was immediately before I went over to Macy's and so my friend was nice enough to get me some coffee because I try to do that before I go to Macy's every time because I need the caffeine. So 
so I can work with people better and be more joyous and energetic because some of the people I go through there are sometimes just like, eh, whatever. So I try to hypen up the mood, you know, try to make a magical experience because that's what we're supposed to do. My eyes look super red right now. It'll be okay. I am going to be hosting my grandparents in just a little bit because they're coming over to visit and I got Megan and Jason and John over here. I had to turn on the Christmas lights because I needed a little bit more Christmassy stuff going on. I was actually dressed in more than I am right now. I have everything except for my suit jacket and tie and socks on. I put on my slippers and I don't even have them on right now because I just needed to air out a little bit. It was just an 11 to 5 shift and I was supposed to go on lunch break at like 1.30 and didn't go on until 3. It was just kind of nuts because I was told that I was going to be going on at 2. 3 o'clock came around but anyway I'm not complaining. I'm just dating something. It was good. The people there I, that I work with they're just so great. They're super nice. We try to be as professional as we can. Not every day is perfect but I've experienced great things with the people that I worked with there so I can't really complain that much. I'm off Macy's tomorrow and I'm going to be going to work at TRBC tomorrow. I won't be vlogging because tomorrow's going to be such a busy day. I don't even know exactly what I'm doing tomorrow. I have a general idea but I know that I'm going to be very busy and I don't usually vlog on Thursdays. Friday is usually the day that I work, that I do my uh, my vlogging. Sorry, I am, I'm so mentally gone right now because it was a lot of figuring things out and stuff just from Macy's so and there's more to come this weekend because I work Friday through Monday. I'm going to get some to eat and I, I'm probably going to be calling it a night soon after that so if I don't see you guys after this then good night.